I'm going to show you how to make some goat cheese mashed potatoes. Russets are always the best to use because they're high in starch, they break down when cooking, and they really absorb good flavors like cream and butter, in this case goat cheese. Now we want to keep these in relatively uniform size pieces because once they hit our boiling water, we want them to all cook evenly and at the same time. We're going to bring these to a boil. The moment this water comes to a boil, we're going to turn it down to a simmer, where they're going to simmer for 25 minutes. Because the boiling method can really break these potatoes down too much. You can uh, really cook out all of the starch. It becomes kind of a uh, kind of a mess. The simmer is going to get them just tender. It's going to lock in all their starches because we want that when we start to mash. The starches releasing are what's going to make these nice and creamy, light and fluffy. So our potatoes have been simmering for about 25 minutes. We're going to give a quick check to be sure they are just perfectly tender. The knife goes very easily right through there, nice and soft, super tender. We are ready to go. It is time to start mashing. Some butter, and we have some cream, a good healthy amount of salt, black pepper, and of course some goat cheese. And you can see the goat cheese is, is very soft, very creamy. And then we're gonna start mashing. You can use a fork, a potato masher, of course. Very simple service here. We're just gonna put a couple of scoops in a bowl. We have some goat cheese to garnish with. And there you have some delicious goat cheese mashed potatoes.